Santonio Brescia on day 5 of Zilex Group to answer to our queries of uh, the Cephla Group. Let us have a look at what he says. So how would you define the current phase of woodworking industry in Italy, rather in Europe as a whole? Look, uh, finally there are good signals and promising signals that we are coming out from the big recession of the last years. So I have to say that it looks promising and we are expecting some uh, good activity in the next months. So we feel uh, reasonably happy. Yes, and now that Zelitsko or Zelitsko gets back, Sefla, Sefla is back to Zelitsko once again. Uh, what are your expectations? How do you meet? Because it's day five. Uh, how was Zelitsko? Uh, during the last years, we have been uh, through a big uh, discussion where to go. We have been to Rimini instead of Milano. Coffee sure. Milano is an international location. All the customers uh, know in Milano. And then we decided to come back to select because there's a better and bigger exposure to the markets. So we believe that we will be stay here longer. And uh, this is the show for the Italian woodworking uh, manufacturers. Okay. And now Silexpo, I find it is just, uh, demonstrating a wide, wide range of products here. So after day five, you can see which one of these are mostly in demand. Cefla uh, is a finishing uh, leader in the world. We have a lot of technologies, but for sure there are some of our technologies that are the core business for us. And uh, these ones are spraying and roller coating. Here on our stand we have many of these technologies with different applications, and both of them, spraying and roller, are giving a lot of satisfaction to us. Okay. Now, you can tell us what makes Cefla finishing group unique compared to the other similar products available in the market? Yes. Cefla is a big company that can uh, also uh, supply uh, all kind of systems to all kind of customers. So we go from big to small, we go from uh, high tech to low tech for customers and we are able to uh, answer to all kind of demands uh, of the customers. Of course, this is supported from a, a network of uh, branches and dealers around the world that can support technically and from the after service of point of view all our uh, customers. That is uh, the most important thing for us. Having, having customers happy is our, our goal. And now Cefla is doing well in the American market as well and IWF Atlanta coming up. What do you think is the basic similarity or you can say difference between these two markets, the European market and the American market? But there are, uh, it depends, it depends it, from the different business. If for example we compare flooring, well, basically the same from North America to Europe, there are not too much differences. Of course, furniture is different. Furniture is a matter of fashion. And you know, the fashion that is dominating the European market at the moment is high gloss. High gloss. In America, not exactly. In America, there is another fashion that is matte, it is it is antique uh, uh, kind, an antique look of the furnitures. But when you have the right technology for both, for us, it doesn't make any difference at the end. So we can answer to, to these markets in the same way, in the same way. no differences. In that regard, uh, how have been India uh, good 2014? Uh, you can tell us, if you can tell us about not only India, the Asian market. But I would like to divide India from the Asian market. India has still to come. India is just opening. Is, uh, is furniture manufacturers to new technologies, especially about finishing. So the best is to come. We are there, we have already happy customers, but if I have to say finishing in India is a mature business, not yet. Okay. It has to come. But we are all investing a lot of time in order to train Indian customers, in order to invest in finishing to improve the quality of their products for the domestic market and for the export.
Asian markets from Vietnam to Thailand to Malaysia to Singapore and to Indonesia they are in this moment ahead of India they already have the knowledge about finishing we have already sold many lines in Southeast Asia and these lines are for all kinds of production they sell from flooring to furniture to tables so there is a big difference between the two markets. One has to become ready in India, the others are ready. Because India is still yet to do really Yeah, yeah. Still, uh, India is promising a lot, but the best has to come. So what would be your marketing strategy for the second half of 2015? Our marketing strategy is always the same, it's uh, to innovate new products, listening to the customers and trying to offer the best for them, to help them to grow, to develop and hopefully to make some money in order to invest more on machines. Yeah. And, and now that you have got an award in the innovation sector from the first ever to Expo Awards, how does it feel? But it's always something that makes us happy. Eh? So we were not expecting that and uh, once we have got it, it's a proof that we are working in the right direction. Congratulations for that. And with the current boom in the social media and the digital media sector, uh, digital marketing sector, how much active is Jack Life? Do you think good working industry should be more on the social media or... Uh... Yeah. Some markets, yes. In some markets there is a good reaction to these new technologies, some markets not, but for sure the direction is that one. The communication is, uh, has changed completely, is changing also in our business, and the future is there, for sure. For sure. So we are investing money, we are, uh, we are getting into the network uh, like everybody. Thank you so much, thank you. Thank you.